Tirupati is a city in the Chittoor district of Andhra Pradesh. The city is home to the important Hindu shrine of Tirumala Venkateshwara Temple and other historic temples and therefore considered as the sacred headquarters of Andhra Pradesh. Tirumala Venkateshwara Temple is popularly known as Tirupati Temple. Tirumala Hills are part of Seshachalam Hills range which comprise seven peaks representing the seven heads of Adishesha. The temple lies on the seventh peak Venkatadri. Therefore, this temple is also known as Saptagiri. The distance from Tirupati to Tirumala is 21 kilometers. The other ghats are Sheshadri, Niladri, Garudadri, Anjanadri, Rishabadri, and Narayanadri. Lakhs of devotees and pilgrims visit this holy shrine for moksha, prosperity, and peace in life. The temple is located on the southern banks of Sri Swami Pushkarini, a holy water tank. Belief is that Lord Venkateshwara bathed in this divine pond along with his wives. This pond is considered as holy as River Ganga. Prime idol of God is known as Venkateshwara, Balaji, Srinivasa, Govinda and of Goddess as Mahalakshmi Padmavati. According to conviction, Lord Vishnu is here along with Sri Devi and Bhu Devi in a very sad form. Tirumala temple finds mention in many Hindu mythologies. Even before the installation of Venkateshwara temple, there is supposed to have existed the Varahamurthy temple which was then known as Adivaraha Kshetra. Apart from this, temple of Radha Krishna and Bedi Anjaniya Swami also exists here. Tirupati Venkateshwara temple is one of the richest temples in the world in terms of donations received and wealth. The temple is run by Tirumala Tirupati Devasthanams TTD, which is under the control of Andhra Pradesh government. Sri Varaha Swami Temple, also called Bhu Varaha Swami Temple, is a Hindu temple dedicated to the god Varaha. The temple is situated on the northern premises of Venkateshwara Temple, Tirumala, on northwest corner of Swami Pushkarini. This temple is believed to be older than the Venkateshwara Shrine. Every devotee visiting Tirupati has to visit this temple. It is believed that Tirumala is owned by Sri Varaha and he has given the space for Lord Venkateshwara. As per the regional legend, after saving the earth from the Asura, Hiranyaksha, Vishnu's boar avatar Varaha stayed on this hill on the northern bank of Swami Pushkarini. Varaha donated land to another form of Vishnu, Venkateshwara, on his request. As gratitude, Venkateshwara offered the right of first bell, puja and nivedyam to Varaha before they were offered to him. This is being followed as a tradition even today. Sri Bedi Anjaneya Swami Temple is located exactly opposite of Lord Sri Venkateshwara Swami Temple in Tirumala. The icon of Lord Hanuman in this temple will be seen in a unique form where both his hands are handcuffed. Sri Wari Museum Photography and videography is banned here. Alwars have a vital position in the growth of Vaishnavism in South India. Both sides of the museum is donned with the statues of Alwars. It contains valuable antique materials to enable an art historian to trace the history and development of temple art. Sri Vari Padalu is situated in the forests on the peak of Narayanadri hill range. Sri Vari Padalu is an important pilgrimage of Tirumala. It is believed 
that this is the place where Lord Narayana first set his foot when he came down from Vaikuntam. Srivari Padalu in English means Lord Venkateshwara's feet. It is 5 kilometers away from the temple. Being a forest, one can see many creatures like forest squirrels. Two rocks connected by a piece of rock is a treat to watch in this place. This place is known as Sila Toranam. There are only three such rock formations in the world, of which this is one in Tirumala. According to geologists, this is about 250 crore years old. Lord has put his foot here from Sri Vara Padalu according to mythology. The height of the presiding deity of Lord Venkateshwara temple in Tirupati is the same as of this rock formation. Chakra Tirtham It is one of the seven holy Tirthams in Sheshadri hills. According to local belief, Lord Brahma wanted to observe penance and to clean this place, Lord Vishnu plunged his Sudarshana Chakra, thus creating a crater for Lord Brahma to sit and meditate. There is a small temple nearby which has Sri Chakratalwar, Sri Narasimha Swami and Sri Anjane Swami's idols. One of the significant festivals of Tirumala, the Chakratirtha Mukkoti, is observed here every year in December. Akasha Ganga is one among the seven sacred rivers of Sheshadri hill ranges. The temple here with idols of both Anjana Devi and Anjaneya attracts devotees from all around the world. According to the Vedas, the falls originated from the holy feet of Lord Venkateshwara. It is said that in the earlier days, the priests of the temple carried water from here to the temple in the wee hours of the morning, the custom of which is followed till date. Papa Vinasham Tirtham, it is one of the seven holy Tirthams in Sheshadri hills. It is believed that the holy water here absolves one from all sins. So, many devotees throng this river for getting moksha from all sins of their present and previous birth. Japali Anjaneya Temple is about 5 kilometers from Tirupati Venkateshwara Temple. This temple is situated inside a dense forest. A deviation has to be taken from the main route and climb stairs to reach this temple, which takes nearly 20 minutes in total. Devotees get rejuvenated from the freshness of the forest area when they walk through. Sitara Kundu is a pond situated behind the main temple. According to certain belief, during the Ramayana era, Sita Devi is supposed to have taken bath in this pond. 
The peaceful ambience of forest created a perfect atmosphere for sages in the olden days to perform penance. Bus facilities are available from Tirupati to Tirumala at a frequency of just two minutes. Devotees can deboard at Tirupati railway station and board buses to Tirumala. Flight facilities are also available to Tirupati from various parts of the country. The airport is situated at Renigunta. Tirupati is 16 kilometers away while Sri Venkateshwara Temple is 39 kilometers away. Online booking service for Temple Darshan. Devasthanam accommodation is available from Rs 100 onwards.